another vlog not with Henia surprise so you might be wondering what I'm doing here and why she's not there and I'm doing this thing or you might have just uh, clicked out already because you're like what the fuck is this shit well thing is I am in Palestine right now I'm in Bethlehem and uh, obviously because it's a zone that is administered by the Palestinian Authority uh, Henia having an Israeli passport could not come here because of how the situation is right now and how it's been for a while but thanks to my handy dandy italian passport i am able to come here and show you around bethlehem yay so if you guys are ready let's get into this video started uh that's what she says isn't it yeah pretty sure So that's what we're doing right now. We're sat in Bethlehem, uh, we went to Hebron, there's some footage there, and now we are on the Herodes mountain. It's a beautiful view. You guys need to see this, all right? So, so, so pretty. So we're on the way to Moses' tomb. Right now, again, just a free tour all around Palestine. So what do you know? I'm in the desert again and there's a camel. Real one. And this is a mosque called An Nabi Musa and apparently the tomb of Moses is right here. And just outside of the mosque there's this cemetery and apparently it's extremely old. It's all of this. This is a cemetery. Apparently it's like 200,000 years old. Very, very old. And really though, what is my life? How did I end up here? Back in the desert, like the Dead Sea is just like 15 minutes away from here. I'm just driving around all <laughs> Palestine for some weird reason. My plan was just staying in Bethlehem for, you know, just a couple hours, go around, see the religious sites, you know, the Church of the Nativity. And I feel like I'm am gonna end up not doing any of that just because i like to go with the flow and the free ride all across the west bank sounds way more interesting to me i'm not a big religious person uh so yay uh we're gonna go to jericho after that hopefully getting some food i don't even know what time it is i don't have wi-fi uh so <laughs> nobody knows except for you guys um, what I'm doing and what I'm up to 
I am starving. I haven't eaten since breakfast. Uh, I've just been drinking a lot of Arab coffee. Delicious, by the way. Uh, tea, obviously, and uh, tobacco. That is, that's been my day. <laughs> So, wanna hear something funny? I'm in the Dead Sea again. <laughs> Literally, what is my life? What has this day been? What is this vlog? Why are you still watching? Uh, no, actually, no, just, just keep watching. This time, I'm actually on like a proper beach. Like there's a whole like resort kind of thing going on. And I got in for free again. <laughs> How do I do these things? Uh, just be nice to people and sometimes people will be nice to you Sometimes though, people are still shit most times But look at this, fancy shit Fancy, fancy shit There's like a proper pool and like changing rooms and there's supposed to be bars and shit Although it's like 5pm so everything's closed right now But yeah, that right there is the Dead Sea again <laughs> Next stop is definitely going to be Jericho. I don't know how much I'm going to be able to go around for. I just really, really need food at this point, but uh, I'll get it. And yeah, and probably I'll be back in Bethlehem. And from there, I'm going to get the bus back. So stay tuned. <laughs> made it to Jericho and here I've got some nice lemonade to keep me going because I still haven't eaten uh, but that's that's fine I'm just past the point of eating at this point <laughs> and yeah this is very nice it's amazing by night I've took some videos uh, I think the camera is almost out of battery so I hope I can make it to the end of this journey I hope I can make it to the end of this journey overall A lot of things are happening right now I don't know where I'm at though But uh, I've got some sugar to keep me going for that Good fucking lemonade mate, good fucking lemonade Jericho, the oldest city in the world This are uh, supposedly the remains of what used to be the old city of Jericho. What is it, 10,000 years old? I think that's about right. What is my life even? What is my life? So I finally got myself some food. We're back in Bethlehem and I got like a falafel sandwich with some salad and then we got some hummus and pita and some dead animals because you know. And we're good company though, so that's great. Thank you. I'm finally happy. So, did you think my little tour was done? Think again. I'm back in Old City, Bethlehem, Manja Square. They still have this amazing huge tree for Christmas. I don't know when they're going to take it down. And to my left, there's the Nativity Church. Apparently Jesus was born there or something like that. Uh, the oldest, if not maybe one of the oldest, all the oldest uh, churches in the world. Pretty cool. And right opposite of that, we have the Omar Mosque. It's a really nice square. So, supposedly Bethlehem is made up of like 50% Christians and so 50% Muslims. And I think. Uh, I've been told it has the biggest population of Arab Christians in the world. It's a pretty cool city, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, it's pretty late, I was supposed to be back in Jerusalem like ages ago, but I don't care, I wanted to see it all, who knows when I'm gonna be back here. And this is amazing, the food was great as well, like we went to this uh, Palestinian restaurant and I had the biggest falafel wrap but I was starving, I haven't eaten anything since uh, breakfast, which which was like at 9am, so I really needed that huge sandwich and uh, I had what is probably the best hummus of my life, I'm sorry Israel, but uh, this hummus in Palestine, way better than what I've had so far though. So far, I could change my mind soon. And yeah, 
and that is where my camera conveniently <laughs> died because it was literally the last stop of my trip uh so hey hey so it's been a while we were just re-watching the footage yeah. and be like mm, i didn't do an outro or anything like that so but how I good of a vlogger she is isn't she Oh, I'm so proud, no. baby. I'm but so I did, proud. I did the best I could, uh, looking at the situation. It was very hectic. I'm sure it was like, now I'm here, now I'm there, now I'm here. But that was That's literally right. the day. It was fucking crazy. I wish you wouldn't have been there. I oh, know. I really, she I had, really did. I am, I'm, I'm not even kidding. I was like upset for like three days when she said she had the best hummus there, and I'm like. I'm making plans with other people. Where's the best hummus? I have to take her to the best hummus. I need her to think that Isra Israeli hummus is the best. But at this point, I kind of just gave up and I have to agree. Like, yes. I'm just jealous. I wanted to be there and eat that hummus with her. Next time. Next time. Next well, time. when there's peace. When there's Which peace. Is Next time, <laughs> when there will be peace, <laughs> you'll be able Good to luck. come with me and Good we can luck. go to all the places. Let's have hope. Okay. <laughs> So how do I close this shit again? Just conclude, say how it was. I had a good time. Lighting is better yes, over there. Yes, I know. There. My my arm is tired. Move like this. Yes. Lighting. Yes, better conditions. Yes. Let's hate it. You're so good though. I really don't know what happened. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't even explain the whole situation. So what happened is, um, as soon as I got off the bus uh, to Bethlehem, I got approached by like, this really, really nice uh, taxi driver who was like, oh, are you here? You're a student, blah, blah, blah. I like you. I can give you this trip for free. Uh, <laughs> that's what I did. I pretty much toured the whole of the West Bank for free <laughs> with a Pakistani couple from uh, East London uh, in the back seat. Uh, they were paying, I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> but that's just me, I guess. I'm just lucky like that. Yep. And it was just great. Yeah, I got to see so many things. I feel so blessed to have had this amazing opportunity. Uh, it's something I always wanted to see. Uh, something that I couldn't film because my camera without a battery was going through the checkpoint, going through the actual wall between Israel and Palestine. That was crazy. That was super upsetting, but... Uh, yeah, it's super fucked up. Very fucked up experience, but you know, one that you should have nonetheless if you're here. Yep. I feel. And uh, yeah, that's it. Didn't cool. Really say more. All right, so uh, thank them for watching. Yes. So thank you guys for watching. I hope it was a list, a little bit good and watchable. It was great. <laughs> it was great, baby. You did such a good job. I'm so proud of you. Tell her to open a fucking channel already. Yeah, everyone keeps asking me that. I'm and still quit not smoking. To you. I'm still not listening to you. Maybe for the second thing, yes, but uh, not the channel thing. Not now. Not now. Help me. What else okay, you say? Uh, you say thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, her channel, if you like this vlog and you want to see more. Um, don't forget to comment on it or like it and uh, um, follow her on Instagram and Snapchat and check out her t-shirt shop. Um, and uh, what else do you have? You have so many things. Ebooks, ebooks. What the fuck is it? Oh yes, and the ebooks. Uh, they're very good. And my Patreon. And the Patreon. <laughs> yes, yes. Support her on Patreon, Thanks, so babe. she can uh, come to London and visit me. <laughs> <laughs> fair enough. Fair enough. Right. Fair game. Fair game. And uh, that's it, right? I think it is. Uh, and I will see you. And I will see you in, in the, the next, next video. video. Love, Love you guys. guys. Bye! Yeah.